Okay, uh, basically uh, this year we have um, participation from uh, many teams. We have 27 teams altogether coming from uh, six countries and uh, I'm quite uh, delighted that uh, many foreign teams, uh, especially Asian, have shown interest to participate in our tournament. And if we look at the uh, participation from the foreign teams, there's strong presence of the team from the Thailand. And these are basically, I would say, that um, team to watch, the Thais, be it in the um, youth division, the under 11, under 13 and under 16, the Kenstar basically are the uh, growing or the development uh, kids from Thailand. It's something that we should watch for. Apart from our Malaysian team, where we are also looking into how we're going to fare against uh, the Thais. And if we look at the women team again, the Thai is also putting up the, um, a strong team, which the players are basically expected to compete in the World Championship. I would expect that uh, the Bangkok Zeus are the team that uh, we should actually be watching. The Asian, the uh, Hong Kong Hitman is another team that we should actually be watching, whereby uh, some of the players are basically competing in the World Championship. Apart from that, I also say that for the local crowd, it's also uh, good to watch our local team, the Snipers, which basically, these are development team, whereby uh, some of the players are relatively young, ages from uh, 14 to 16 and these are the teams that we are going to actually groom for the future and um, we are basically giving exposure to these uh, young players and the snipers we expect not to perform very well however we are looking at the snipers to compete with the other best team within the Asian region and for the international I'll be looking at the uh, Singapore teams um, the um, uh, Pandu Nation they are basically uh, very strong teams uh, which they have competed in uh, Hong Kong and won the tournament. Apart from our local team, the Cobras should give uh, a tough fight against the Singapore team.